Hello everyone. Uh, we are going to show you how we make our special Naga paste. Um, Pete, I think he mentioned in one of his uh, write-up. So for you, Pete, and others who are watching, this is how we make our um, Naga paste, special hot Naga chili paste. And these are the ingredients we use. Here we are. We have some parch prawn, which is a mixture of five different spices. There we go. Veggie oil. We have a couple of chopped up garlic here. Two kg of uh, we we call them African naga, which is uh, Scotch bonnet. Yeah, there we are. Scotch bonnet here. It comes from varieties countries, but mainly the ones we use come from Uganda. There we are. You can get them in all majority of Asian supermarkets. So most of the big large supermarkets have them nowadays. And here we have a a pint of white vinegar. And Pete mentioned about Mr. Naga, which is a it's ready-made paste. You can get them in the supermarket nowadays. There we are, it's called Mr. Naga. But we don't use that, we use our own mix. There we go. Lovely, and we will show you how we make our Naga paste. There we go. Chef Imran is tipping the oil in there now. Just putting the punch prawn there, the five different spices, which is onion seed, cumin seed, mustard seed, and two more other spices goes in the punch prawn. Yeah. Next thing, the garlic goes in. Right, we wait till the. Now he's going to tip the. Pot down over there. There we go. Now Even a good mix, mix the old spice together. And we leave this to cook for how long? Uh, five, seven minutes. Ten, yeah, about five to ten minutes cooking time. We'll top the vinegar in.
Well, it's been about seven minutes, seven to eight minutes of cooking time, and now we're going to tip the uh, the vinegar in. Right vinegar. And then give it a good stir. And then you will cook for another 10 minutes or so till, till the scotch bonnet simmers and becomes all soggy. Then what will the next procedure, what, we'll, what we normally do, we will we'll let it cool down and put it in a, a tight uh, a glass jar to keep the, the aromatic, the taste inside. So when we need some, we just take some out and blend it. Uh, and I'm out of the Here we are. Uh, this is our final product uh, of our scotch bonnet, the Naga chili sauce. As you can see, we've done the cooking for about 20 minutes. Now our naga is, the scotch bonnet is ready. Now we'll store this in a, a very tight lid jar so we don't lose the aromatic flavor. And as you can see, simmer down. We leave this. Whenever we need some, we just take out some and blend it. And by side, we have the, the final product of our naga sauce here. Now when we make vindaloo, we always make sure we, the chef Imran puts only, I retreat only one table, only one teaspoon, sorry, teaspoon full of this paste. Now to make him a dress, we only put half teaspoon of the paste. Now, if you want to, if you do like your hot curry, you can always put two table, two teaspoon. But please don't go wild because this is deadly. So. This can do you a little damage, so don't go wild. Just make sure you, when you make this stuff, make sure you use appropriate amount. But I can show you this is really, really hot. Once again, thank you so much for watching our video.